Hello, I'm Isaac Keith Martinez, and welcome to my show, Isaac's Haunted Beard. You can actually call me Isaac. Um, this is the first episode of Isaac's Haunted Beard, and you may wonder, why is it called Isaac's Haunted Beard? Well, I'm happy you asked, because I'll tell you. I'm usually a clean-shaven person. In fact, to be quite honest with you, um, I have a hard time growing a beard. But the weirdest thing happened to me one day. I woke up one morning, I went to the bathroom, I looked in the mirror, and I had this full face of hair. I had, a, I had a beard. I've never had a beard in my life, and now I have a beard. So I looked at myself in the mirror and I went, how could this be? How could it that I now have a beard? And at that moment, this voice came out of nowhere that said, I am. I don't sound like that. Oh, okay, that's true, you don't sound like that. Ladies and gentlemen, that's that's the voice of my haunted beard. I have a haunted beard. Um, there's a spirit that has somehow gotten to my face and made me grow a beard. And I was really scared at first, but uh, you know, I did some talking, met the spirit, hung out a little bit, found out not such so, not such a bad spirit. Uh, turns out it doesn't really want to like possess me or make me spin my head around or spit green goo or get anything bad. Uh, just wants to hang out and for the most part is willing to leave me alone on the condition that I start a show. So I did. I started this show, Isaac's Haunted Beard. Huh? Good title, huh? I'm so excited about my first episode that I wrote a song about it. it goes like this. Welcome to the vo- That's all I got so far. Um, anyway, uh, Haunted Beard. Uh, what would you like to me to talk about in this first episode? I want to know what uh, horror movies you like watching in October. I am so happy you asked me that completely unplanned question that I didn't prepare for in advance because I happen to have this stack of horror movies right here. I'm going to go through them. I'm not going to review them. I just want to give you a taste of what I like and what I like to watch during the month of October because like a lot of horror nerds I like to watch a lot of horror movies, especially in the month of October. To celebrate Halloween. Halloween? Did someone say Halloween? Yeah, I just did. Halloween. John Carpenter's Halloween. Yes, this is the dope version. I love Michael Myers. I love it so much about the CD because I love that music. Favorite theme song of all time. I love it. I like to make love to it. All right, Halloween 2. Rick Rosenthal's Halloween 2. I love it. Uh, it takes place in a hospital. Um, it's awesome. And I always try and squeeze this in every October. Uh, believe it or not, I like Rob Zombie's Halloween. And uh, this is the soundtrack. This isn't the DVD or the Blu-ray. Actually, my grandma is borrowing the Blu-ray right now. Of uh, She came up to me one day. She's like, Isaac, I really want to watch a movie where someone kills a lot of people with a knife. And I, just, and I said, Halloween, honey. Uh, uh, just take it and enjoy. And she said, thank you. You're such a good grandson. I said, I know. Anyway. Rob Zombie's Halloween, pretty awesome. Rob Zombie's Halloween 2. I love this movie. I love it a lot. It's awesome. More killing, more shenanigans. Um, I like movies that take place on Halloween in October, like Trick or Treat, horror anthology, with uh, three or four stories that are kind of intertwined. Uh, film came a couple years ago. Super awesome. Check it out. Speaking of Trick or Treat, what about this one? Trick or Treat. Yeah, this is the one with Scapey from Family Ties, where you play the record backwards, guy comes out of the speaker, kills all the bullies that's, you know, tormenting the heavy metal nerd. Love this movie. That's the way it does the soundtrack. Rock on. Alright, Night of the Demons. Love Night of the Demons. Take place in horror. Uh, horror. Halloween? Halloween? Thanksgiving? No, Halloween. Um, Linnea Quigley, horror icon screen queen in this movie. Shows her boobs. Okay. Um, oh, skipping back to Mr. Zombie. House of a Thousand Corpses, anyone? Takes place on Hallow's Eve. Halloween Eve and then Halloween. Got it on DVD, too. Why? Because I like spending money on important things like this. Anyway, I'm going to wrap it up with this one. Disney's, the advent, well, it's called The Adventures of Ichabod and Mr. Toad, if you buy the DVD, but really it's, um, it's, uh, The Legend of Sleepy Hollow. You may know it from, uh, Tim Burton's movie with Johnny Depp, or there's a current television show 
which is pretty cool. This is the animated one. I love this movie. And there you go. I watch these movies every October because they're fun and they take place on Halloween. Uh, hey, what do you guys watch? Uh, send me an email. I'm at isaacshauntedbeard at gmail.com. Don't put the, um, in between the C and the S, don't, don't put the, you know. Uh, let me know. Make, make a video. Make videos just like this one, you know. Interact with your uh, haunted body parts. Um, anyway, this is the first episode. I hope you enjoy it. Please subscribe to our, our, our show. Uh, I don't know how often I'll do stuff. Hopefully, regularly, semi-regularly. As this continues, hopefully it grows. I might do more things with the computer, with the internet. Who knows? Maybe, maybe Twitter. Maybe, I don't know. Maybe I'll make spaghetti. Spaghetti. Mm. Delicious.